The clock is ticking for Bennett College in Greensboro. February 1st is the deadline for the school to raise $5 million or else it could lose its accreditation. As of this morning, Bennett tweeted out it is 62% of the way there, less than 40% to go as we creep closer to Friday. WFMY News News Alma McCarty sat down with Bennett's president about the progress. A little over $3 million. That's how much money Dr. Phyllis Worthy Dawkins says Bennett has raised so far after the school lost its membership to SACS, the accrediting body for hundreds of colleges across the Southeast. We are being removed from membership because we have not met one out of 95 standards, and that one is called financial resources. So the only thing we can present to support the strength of our appeal is uh, additional resources. Dawkins says money keeps pouring in, people donating online, through text, even by traditional snail mail. She remains confident Bennett can raise the money in time to keep its accreditation. If, it, if they don't, they, those donations will still go towards the college's appeals process. It will still be used uh, by the institution to support our appeal. And we never know. It may work with the funds we've raised, but we would like to nail it. We would like to get the exact amount. Other grads like Linda Brown also feel confident, even this close to the deadline. Brown says Bennett College and Greensboro go hand in hand, an essential part of the community that needs saving. All of us are saying this can't happen. We are not going to close no matter what happens, whether we get to that goal or not, um, there's, there, there has to be some other alternatives. Coming up at 6, I'll introduce you to a classroom of first graders helping out Bennett one quarter at a time.